Hi friends, we're going to discuss about job seeker visa in this video. There are a lot of requests or queries that are coming to me to talk about this job seeker visa. The first thing I would like to tell you about job seeker visa is it gives a great opportunity for those job seekers in Germany to have good access to the job opportunity. As a job seeker visa applicant, once you get the visa, you have the six months period to stay in Germany and look for jobs. This is going to give you an opportunity just equal to those people who are in Germany. This job seeker visa has got certain criteria in with respect to the qualifications and the experience you need to have. The first criteria is that you need to have an academic background which is actually recognized by the German framework. So you can look at the visa application or you have the other standard web which are going to give you a clear picture about what is the standard a degree at which university and what is the equivalent degree in Germany. That database we call it as Anabin database and you can look at that. Now once you apply and get the visa you can travel to Germany and stay here for six months as a normal resident and this gives you a clear opportunity to put a German address on your application which helps employers to know that you are living in Germany and you are also available readily to attend the interviews in person. And this is a major difference and biggest advantage for those people who are staying in Germany and applying for jobs because the employer sees a German address and not an address outside Germany and he is ready to proceed ahead with the further rounds of interview or application process. Whereas when you apply from India or some other location, when they see the Indian address location, they might see, okay, I have other applicants who are already staying here locally and now let me approach them first and then go for the other people who are accessible from outside Germany. So this is a major advantage for the job seeker visa applicants where they can come here, stay here for six months and then search for the job opportunities. The third uh, biggest advantage most of the official websites don't tell and uh, what I have experienced is you have access to not only the German opportunities but also the opportunities that are there in Netherlands and some other country as well where you can actually directly apply for them and uh, because you like get a Schengen visa or some kind of approval to travel to other locations inside the Europe you will be able to broaden your opportunities to other countries countries as well something like Netherlands or Belgium or France or something like that this gives you a clear opportunity for broader market job market but also look at the regulations around it but I I have never seen any problem in terms of applying for jobs in Netherlands or some other areas and just travel to that country and approach that so this is a third advantage but not everything is green in with the job seeker visa the first thing is that the time for applying for this visa takes minimum of six weeks to eight weeks which is going to be very long the second criteria where many ignore is the number of applications you have already put for the german employers one important factor that comes in job seeker visa is that how many applications did you put for German job opportunities and then the number of responses you got back from the German applicants. So this is a very important factor because this is going to tell to the German embassy that you are getting responses and you are going to make your chances of getting employment much more better when you are in Germany. This is a very important case that a lot of people ignore. Start applying well before you apply for a German job seeker visa. And if you get three to four or at least five uh, responses back from the employers that uh, your application is being accepted and you can attend further interview rounds, then this is a very good case that you can apply for job seeker visa and it actually strengthens your application. The next important part is about finances. You have to have a blocked German account where you have to put the six months of your expenses into that account and uh, you have to show those finances to the embassy which they will understand that you have sufficient funds to sustain in Germany, live for six months and then cover your expenses. Now there is a catch here. A blocked account is not just enough. The idea is that you, wherever you're going to live, do a thorough analysis of your expenses. That is very important because your stay is going to cost, then your food expenses and all the other travel expenses. You should do a good thorough planning around it. And if you do not have that sufficient funds, then there is something called declaration of commitment. In German, we call it Verpflichtungserklärung. And if someone who is residing in Germany 
and working in Germany, if they are willing to give that, this is going to be a strong proof that your day-to-day -day expenses or stay is taken care by somebody else in Germany. So mostly if you have a brother or sister who is working in Germany and willing to give it for you, then it is a wonderful case where you once you have this document, it's going to be a very strong case for the job seeker visa. But remember, the person who is giving this document has to show their three month salary statements and there are two types one is for the job seeker visa and second one is for the visitors visa to get one for the job seeker visa you should go to foreign office and tell that you want to invite your friend who want to have this job seeker visa the major issue when it comes to job seeker visa i have seen four to five people struggling for finances after coming to germany remember it's a poor planning that i would call the reason why they have struggled is that they have not estimated that it would take long to actually get a job in their field because of the language restrictions because they were applying for consultant positions and they were applying for some kind of client communication client interaction roles where they mandate knowledge of german language is necessary they have they had very limited opportunities and what happened is that to find the right role in a company where English is accepted, they had struggled for more than four to five months and you know what happens, you are not earning in India and you are looking for job here so you have expenses at home and you have expenses here as well. So if you don't have enough finances planned then everything is going to spiral out and by the end of this six months the pressure of looking for job goes high and it is going to impact in many ways it is very important that you should plan your finances and plan your stay meticulously i would recommend get in touch with somebody who is already there in germany in a small town or a middle town or at least students and try to find an accommodation a shared accommodation which will reduce your cost of living dramatically this is very important factor the next important factor i would say is that do a thorough research on the job opportunities before you come on job seeker visa if your field or if your skill set does not offer a broad range of opportunities then be very careful to apply for the job seeker visa ensure that you have broader range of opportunities and you have the entry is easy for you into the job market then please go ahead and apply for it but if you have very narrow field of job opportunities then be very careful and my advice for those people who come to germany on job seeker visa is once you register as a resident here you have six months to stay and a lot of people do a mistake that they only focus on job opportunities hardly you will apply for four or five hours in a day for job opportunities and in a week or two you will get one or two interviews but my strong suggestion is go and join a german language course here in germany make your german language skills better in six months you can learn a lot of language there are courses where you have course from 8 to 12 on four days a week or something like that there will be rigorous courses that happen and here in germany it's a very good opportunity to stay in germany and learn the german language because you have more contact with the language and with the german language knowledge you will be able to broaden your job opportunities and this gives you a better confidence into your job in the future as well i always suggest whoever come to jo germany on job seeker visa don't put the language as a second priority bring it forward and try to accommodate in your six months period so that you get a big advantage out of this this is very important and especially for those people who are trying for jobs in chemical and mechanical fields operation engineers and all those people remember that the next important part that i would like to say about job seeker visa that about travel and accommodation and your home finances back in india cover all scenarios plan for the worst case scenario and have that extra cash as a cushion this is very important the last part i would like to tell you is having a job seeker visa is going to give a lot of advantage because once an employer is ready to roll out an offer your process of applying for a work visa is easy because you are just going to local foreign office and show the contract saying that i got a contract now i want to convert my visa to a work visa and the process here here in uh, local foreign office is much easy than approaching a German embassy back there and up waiting for four to eight weeks. Of course, here also there'll be some more time that is required to get a 
kind of a visa conversion but uh, anyways you get a temporary document saying that the process is going on it is much easy when you have an offer and just go to the foreign office and get the visa type converted to work permit directly a blue card or something like that this is going to be a bigger advantage the employers will also have confidence that the visa process is going to be easy and you will be able to join immediately in a given time frame and this is going to give you a lot of advantage if you have any questions or queries related to this kind of visa or job application process i have a course on udemy and also in teachable where you can register to that course to get a clear overview about the whole process and the next part is that you can also book an appointment with me directly to speak about your particular case or to get a personalized suggestion about your job search process So that's all for this session. Thanks a lot. Have a nice day. Bye.